So you've determined that you have parasites and you're looking to do a cleanse. But one important thing to consider during this process is your diet. So when you're parasite cleansing, it's really important to eat foods that are light, warm, freshly prepared, and easy to digest. This diet will discourage parasitic infections by limiting the production of AMA, which is metabolic toxins, and it will strengthen your agni, or your ability to digest food and life. This diet works because parasites thrive in an immune system that is weak and in a body that consumes cold, non-fresh foods and processed foods. So that means during this cleanse, you'll wanna reset your digestive system using food Foods, strengthen your agni with lifestyle practices, and then use herbs to get rid of the parasites. Because if you're just using herbs alone and not changing your diet or lifestyle, that will not be enough. All right, so if you wanna get rid of these parasites for good, it's important to commit to making these changes to your diet first. The longer you eat poorly is the more that the parasites will thrive in your system. All right, so we're gonna commit to making a serious effort to cleaning up our diets and you'll actually be surprised to see that you'll see permanent relief. Okay, so two weeks leading up to your parasite cleanse, start removing foods from your diet that feed parasites. These include refined sugars, natural sugars, most starches, processed foods, dairy products, but not including ghee and homemade buttermilk, and meats as well as unhealthy fats. During these two weeks, this is what you should be consuming, healthy, balance bowls. So these should consist of lentils or easy to digest beans such as split mung beans, whole mung beans, azuki beans, and black lentils. Whole grains are also really good such as basmati, jasmine rice, quinoa, barley, and buckwheat. Also, you wanna have an augmenting vegetable with it as well such as carrots, beets, turnip, or sweet potatoes. The last thing you wanna to add to that bowl is an extracted vegetable. These can be spinach, asparagus, collard greens, dandelion greens, or arugula. Okay, so if you've caught some good gems so far, like this video, subscribe to the channel so you know when we drop the follow-up video to this one. When preparing your meals, be sure to cook each ingredient separately using ghee, organic sesame oil, or unrefined coconut oil only if you live in a warm climate. Use spices to increase digestibility. Some really great spices to use are cumin, coriander, fennel, turmeric, ginger, black pepper, and even clove. So the point of eating like this during the weeks leading up to your parasite cleanse is to train your body to recognize real food, cooked from scratch, and fresh food consumed daily at the right times. This sets you up for a powerful and successful cleanse.